why, 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 why? Oh, look, we're live. Are we live? Oh, I'm throwing stuff on the floor. <laughs> Is it Friday yet? Yes. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Are we happy? It's Friday. We're a little um, what are they? Slap happy. I think we, is what she meant to say. That. Yeah. <laughs> we were thinking that we should have Joyce actually laying up on this counter with her hands and feet up in the air to show that it's been a full week. Been a full week, and Katie and I this morning said, "Oh, we're so happy. It's Friday." <laughs> <laughs> There's Kate. Are you over there? There you are. Yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> Come over and be the camera girl. Oh, you wanted Katie. me to, you didn't want to. <laughs> oh, and back to Katie. There she is. All right, let's switch her around. So Barb, Nick pointed out that this, this iPad tends to focus in and out, not super well. So we've been working on getting our studio set up. Internet just decided to not work very well. So unfortunately, we're stuck with this iPad. And our our weird folks, but we're gonna make it work. We will. We're good. Thank you for joining us. We're good. Thank you for joining us. And um, go ahead. Well, I was gonna say we have a few uh, public announcements. We do. Tim. Yes. Yeah. So we keep every time we do a checker order, which is a major distributor for us, um, we throw in a couple and other bolts of SF, SF 101 because everybody wants SF 101 for their mask, right? And then I send my order, and the order comes. It's done. And I'm like, I thought I put it in. So then I put two more in. Joyce does an order. And I do three more. She puts three more and in. And three more. And so we got another <laughs> order in today. And I was like, what the? We're What's digging the, through the box. Like, where is there? Because we keep telling you that it's going to be here any, like, it should be in our next order. So I went back on the website today. We have 12 bolts now on order, mm -hmm. which is a we lot. Want, we want them all. <laughs> Give them to us. Give them to us. <laughs> so I actually called, and they said Pelon is not shipping it to them until the end of the month. So we are not going to have SF-101, which are so many of you are using for your mask, until um, May. 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 <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Nothing to be done. And Alaska, 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 Alaska is kind of the same. I think I'm in Ohio. She's in Alaska. <laughs> Alaska has a very similar situation where there is such a bag lock. Bag my goodness! It's Friday. It's she was Friday. gonna walk out here with a bottle of wine. I, I did say I should come out with a bottle of wine because everyone thinks I've been drinking all week, but it's that. I'm just, it's been frenetic. We're exhausted. Been, we're exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> we're exhausted. But we're happy. We're a little punchy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, same thing is true. This big backlog of elastic as well. Um, and so uh, we sh are hoping to have a big shipment at the end of next week, early the following week. But um, so you might want to just stop asking us for a little bit. And we'll <laughs> let you know because at least... Well, not half of our phone calls, but a lot of our phone calls are, is Elastic in yet? And order more SF-101. Mm -hmm. And we have to say no to both of those requests right now. So we have long lists of people that are looking for it. And we'll make a big announcement because we'll we should get a lot. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And then uh, it's coming. I'll let you know. Mm -hmm. But so it's not for a lack of effort. It's not. No, it's not. All right. So, so the theme of today. Bill Bartolini wants to know what's today's topic. Oh, what well, would you? Is it time? Oh, Mr. Bill. All right. We missed you yesterday, Bill. We, yes. we called you out even on the I video. Know. Thank you for joining us. Yeah. Thank you all for joining us. Definitely. What is our topic today, Kathy? So actually, our topic for today is Joyce. No, She's <laughs> I'm not the topic for today. Ask you questions. No, that's right. The topic right. for today. We had a couple of people ask us to go back to the basics. And so I, because we kind of jumped into mm -hmm. AccuQuilt, we never kind of started at the beginning. And Joyce is the queen of AccuQuilt. So I'm going to just step off the stage and I'm going to let Stepping Joyce have it. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. All, all right. right. Well, this is very basic. And I apologize to all of those of you who already have your AccuQuilt cutters and your experts. I know there's so many of you. But we thank all of you for joining us because this is just our chance to connect with you. We love uh, visiting with you, and we love that you tune in and just join in our silliness. So let me, I don't have all of our arms, Kathy, sorry, Katie. I'm making Katie do back bends. I'm so sorry. But um, so we're going to talk about the AccuQuilt cutter today, and I'm going to put it down so you can see me. <laughs> so this is actually the original AccuQuilt cutter. This is the manual um, cutter with this little um, wheel, the, the um, 
you know. It more. turns. Feel the turns. The handle, the handle, the handle turns the handle. Okay. So very easy. So um, it, it stores that small. And then you just open it up and it's ready to go. That's all there is to it. Okay, so an AccuQuilt cutter is compression cutting. So uh, what you have is um, this that has the rollers on it and the handle to move it through. And then you have, um, for this particular one, this is just called the Original Go. And so the Go has uh, comes with this particular die. And it has two squares and one set of half square triangles. Okay, it's a value die comes with the match just like that and so all it is simple super and then um, the, there is a proper way the recommended way to do okay you'll see on the dies that there is a label right here so this label all I can see today is Katie's eyebrows I don't get her smiling eyes there she is that's much better Katie. I'd like to see I'm her smiling eyes just noting everyone's saying it's blurry and I'm not oh. sure what's different today um you know I wonder if my camera lens let's see what, if we let's, do that. What's up? <laughs> Kathy used her, her shirt to clean the lens one And the reason why it's so accurate is because you're going to and um, so it will cut, everybody knows this, but even Brett knows the answer to this. We can cut how many layers at a time? Six! Six, Six layers <laughs> at a time, which is really fast and really accurate. And as far as I have a lot of people ask, is there a lot of fabric waste? with the AccuQuilt cutter, and I personally don't think there is, as long as you're covering up this image. So like, it's, they have contrasting, so you know whether it's going to cut or not, right? It's gonna cut it, because I can't see what's underneath. And then here's the other one here. I'm gonna just cut. But because it's compressing it underneath these rollers, that's what, look how easy this is. <laughs> yes, you can have your coffee. Yes, well, but with my Go Electric, I could go do a load of laundry or something in the meantime. I wouldn't have to stay with it. But I love not doing laundry. I love being able to walk away just by giving that one a tap. But this one, you have to keep rolling until it's finished. But it's done, right? So I'm finished cutting. I can do the six layers at a time. As it goes through, because it pushes it down, it's um, conducting like, static electricity under there. So if I were to pick this up, I'd have like half here and half here. So I'm just going to kind of press and twist, and it looks like this. And there. You can do that really, really fast. Everything is perfect and your points are perfect, okay? So this is what comes with the AccuQuilt Cutter Original. And this runs $2.99. That's what that one is. Now, they have an, um, the electric, the Go Big Electric, which we've been demoing on 
show them how it works. Yeah, it's pretty case, cool. Just in case you guys have never tuned in before, if this is your first time, welcome. And if this is your first time, we don't typically have such a bad connection. There's something in the air where it's going in and out, but I think the whole video is recording and will certainly be on YouTube as well. So Joyce will be very consistently speaking when you tune in later. We'll give it a try. Okay, this is my honey. I love this thing. <laughs> this is the AccuQuilt Go Big. So when they came out with this, it just made my life so much easier. So now, remember how the other one, I just opened it up and laid it flat. When I got mine, I went home and I'm like, this is not open. I'm like, how, well, how do I do this? So for those of you who get your new cutters, there are little feet on one side. So just remember to put it on its feet, okay? Once you have it on its feet, then it opens up very nicely. So just like that, okay? This is a go big. And then all you're going to do is you're going to plug it in little place on this side you plug it in and there's a green dot you're going to push that and you're ready to go on that green button so with the go big you get the flying geese die I'm not disappearing <laughs> so this is the flying geese die that comes the go big it has a quarter and triangles so you can use these independently of each other if you if you need to and so again, I'm just going to cover up the image. And you can use these for just about anything. It's pretty sweet. I can actually put a couple of those on there. Look at that. See, I just took my, my fabric and folded it, and I'm going to pop that on there. So this die that goes with the, um, the Go Big it comes with a flying piece. Um, it runs $5.99. They actually have a rebate going on right now. So if you really like a little extra money so um, you can buy this from us we'll give you this sheet of paper and um, depending on how fast you want it you can send it in right away there is a deadline but you'll get a hundred dollars back off of it and that's quite a deal all you need to do is um, send it in with your receipt and your UPS bought in the box and you're good to go because I know someone just bought that one yesterday so this is my reminder to you <laughs> send it in all right okay so I have this layer and now this is where where did I put I don't even have to pay attention. Go rescue it. You can just leave it hang there. It's okay. You can leave it hang. All right. So now this one. Do you see how much easier that was? So I don't have to stay with it until completion. Same thing. I'm just going to love it. I'm going to just twist is what I normally do. And you're like, that's what it looked like going in, and this is what it looks like coming out. Whoop, not like that. I have a little hanging there, which is normal. But look at that. Look how beautiful that is. on the back of your fabric. You see all that, Miss Katie? Mm -hmm. All right, so you could just put that on the back of your fabric with this light steam seam too, which is our favorite, I think, everybody on yeah. staff. And you just, I can just press it. Look, it's on there. It's ready to go. And then what you would do is just put it on your mat, send it through the cutter, and then it comes out like this. Okay, so these have already been prepared. And it has the light steam seam too, so it's sticking to it. <laughs> it's doing its job. It's doing its job. But the nice thing about it is there's no tracing. There's no um, cutting, you know, t uh, multiple times. And then you would just put it onto your background. So here, I'm going to applique it on the top. 
go. <laughs> so, and it's kind of arms too. So you can actually um, do the little windows. I don't know if you can see that because it's pretty wild. And you know, wouldn't this be fun if you had grandchildren or little um, children around and you can have them cut out a bunch of your scraps and assemble, they can make whatever they want. They can cut out all kinds of, table. yes, I will. It's cause that's a little busy, but here it comes. Yeah. Er, okay, <laughs> here it is. Actually, we'll put it right here. It is pretty busy. But you can do that with all their, all their um, applique dies. It makes it very simple. That layer of light seam seam two is considered a half layer. So instead of doing six layers, you'd be able to do four at a time, which is really nice. Oh, look, I still have it on here. There you go. All right, so that is with applique. Now the other nice thing, those of you who like to do embroidery, okay, I have to take time out for a, uh, a special, oh, happy to me. Uh, today, I was surprised because Miss Pam Churches came into um, <laughs> our, our came to our shop, so she um, surprise called, and she was out in the parking lot, and she had her little Yorkie Dakota sticking out her head out of her coat. So cute. But anyway, she said, can you just come to the door? And when Pam and I travel, uh, she's usually my roommate, and she has caught me before with a curler in my hair on the way out of the door. So she is my, my personal checker. So she made me this today. Speaking of embroidery, so... <laughs> with curlers in my hair oh! it me out. <laughs> so it made me smile today thank you Pam <laughs> I was cracking up all right anyways that was just an aside if you do like to do embroidery they have um, for all their new dyes and everything going forward most of their dyes now have embroidery files that come um, so if I bought this uh, car for instance what I would do is I, I would go onto their website. It's a free embroidery download. And what they do is they give you the outside of the shapes to embroider, which is great. So you, could, you don't have to do your um, buttonhole stitch or, or your zigzag on your own, just on your sewing side. You can actually do an embroidery as well, okay? Which, like if you wanted to do this train, I've had people buy this train and you can really personalize it however you want. That would have embroidery. Look at these. We have alphabets, so all, and we have a couple different fonts. So we have this one. The possibility endless. We have this guy with the bigger, bolder letters. We have numbers. And so you could put them on things like pennants. Maybe you wanted to do a welcome home sign or something encouraging, some kind of encouraging message. So you can have that all. But I think that would be a really fun family project to do together because you could just, yeah, cut out and put things together and they look so professional looking. So that is um, the cutters and, and the um, there's so many different possibilities. If they do a curved one, let me get my Cleopatra fan. So... This is such a beautiful pattern. This is called Cleopatra's fan, and you will notice that there are curves in here, and a lot of people don't like curves. Kathy was actually talking about this um, yesterday, yes. right? Yeah, that's yeah. Gonna be I think next week we're going to focus on curves. Oh, well, piecing. this is perfect. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, I love curve piecing with the AccuQuilt cutter, and, and this is actually when I really use my fuse weezers <laughs> Oh, yeah, those fuse weezers We fuse love those. The new great. tool. Yeah, because I just hold, whenever there is a curve, they put a notch in it, so you just know that um, your notches, they just match. Everything's perfect, so it comes out very nicely. Actually, here's an example of that. This is Cleopatra's fan. Whoops, there you go. Thank you, Kathy. This is Cleopatra's fan. So all these curves were so nicely nice to do, and they lay so flat. That's what I love about them. Everything lays so nice and flat on these. There's no, you know, right. mishaps. Right. So... When they, people ask, you know, does it use more fabric? Really, how many times would you cut out something like this and you have to pitch part of it because it just didn't come out right and you'd have to cut it out all over again? And how long would it take you to cut these out? It takes a long time, but not with the AccuQuilt cutter. <laughs> it goes very quickly, so it's very gratifying. Here's another example of applique. So this is Edita Sitar's um, Butterfly, and these were actually some of the um, the designs, the free embroidery designs that are online. So this was done with the embroidery machine, and it's done with actually this die right here. So there you go. Super simple. There goes Cleopatra. <laughs> All right. <laughs> are there any questions yet? Awesome machine. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's what Pat Kinman says. Yes. Pat, you are right. We Cubes. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, so the other thing is we have um, the cubes. So I hate for anybody to go um, 
out of the building with a cutter and not get a cube because to me this is like a rotary mat okay Th these are your cutters and your rulers right your shapes are here so what you want to do is you want to get a cube so the cube has a wonderful storage system and there are eight dies in here everything from squares to parallelograms rectangles quarter square triangles half square triangles everything you need to do just about any block these are the 72 blocks that you can get free actually it's on here there it is right there but you can get the free patterns online through AccuQuilt and um, you can do every single one of these blocks most of you probably want to do every block like this and throw them all together you could do a whole quilt with one block I right? love it's, that quilt <laughs> it's all like I love it <laughs> so the nice thing about it is they're numbered so when you are doing this let me pull it out it's hard to do things backwards all right so here you go you have this is one through four and they all sit in there. Each one of these dies has a pattern to go with it. And then, um, and then as far as sewing them together, there is, so here they would have like, you can, you can just look at the picture and say, okay, I want to make these boats. I need dies two and five. You pick out die two, die five, and you cut them out and you can just, it's like cutting and sewing by number. It's so simple, very gratifying. And um, to add to that, um, AccuQuilt actually has $15 off right now on their cubes. So um, that is something to really take advantage of. But you really want to be able to use that. And, and the cubes come in different sizes, right? Yes, 6, 8, 9, 10, and 12 inch cubes. And we're actually getting ready to put an order in at, after we're done here today because we have um, things that we need to order and replenish. The other thing I wanted to tell you is that um, with the the original go crank they have um, that machine they have this eight inch cube that I just showed you so this cube finishes at with eight inch blocks so it comes with that cube which normally runs 220 remember that the um, machine itself is 299.99 you also get a book and you get this their most popular die which is the two and a half inch strip cutter that you can use for bindings you can use for um, uh, your jelly roll patterns is so easy and then you get the mat to go with it and these run about ninety dollars your mat runs about twenty five and remember I said the original was two ninety nine right and I just told you all these prices but there's a set called the ready set go and you get all of those it's four forty nine what a deal but they also have a hundred dollar rebate going on right now so for about fifty dollars more than your the, the crank that I showed you that's two ninety nine ninety nine you get all of that. So it's if you're thinking about it, it's a really good time to do that. And I'm going to keep it short as possible today. So um, I, have, I was mortified how long we went the other day after Katie told us. I was like, oh, no, my it was gosh. like a TV episode. I was it was like, blah 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 blah. Okay. <laughs> so, I love you. You have such important things to say. So, anyways, I wanted to show you this because Tina made this, and this is with the. Um, this die right here. This is the half hexagon die. Isn't that gorgeous? So pretty. And you think that it's um, the um, pentagon, right? Two, four, six. No, hexagon. <laughs> hexagon. Geometry is yeah. coming back. Oh, that geometry. I know. You don't can't worry get away about from that bar. Map. You don't have to think about it. Just put it on there and slap it down, and it'll cut. So, um, but it, so instead, it just does half at a time. So there's no Y seams. You just do a whole row just these edges together and then when you sew that row to that row it creates this hexagon is that the coolest thing ever and she used this summertime layer cake to make these isn't that awesome i love that fabric yes we have another great sample um that sally made that's on the long arm now that uses this fabric we i just, haven't had a chance to quilt it <laughs> i've been staying been so, so busy, busy. oh my true. god <laughs> yes but it's a great summertime it is it's great summertime. the other quilt. thing i wanted to tell you about this particular one is i think she said you use she's four or five machines she used the AccuQuilt cutter to cut out her fabric and then she used her um, Bernina to piece her quilt together. And then she used her Sashiko to do on it. Beautiful. Uh, those of you who are going to be in her, uh, Tina's club, her class, she does beautiful. It looks like it was done by hand. She used her Sashiko machine to do that. And then she used her baby lock machine to do her binding. <laughs> so those of you who think we're playing favorites, we love them all. It's we true. love them all. Totally. So, I think um, I think that's pretty much it. I think that's about it. So I'm gonna come around and just say, 
it's been a great week with you guys, mm -hmm. and thank you for coming to see us and yes. spending an hour with us or Being a half hour with or us. 20. Being patient with <laughs> right. us. And, and we know the quality of these videos are we still... are not professionals yet, but we will be. We are really working on it. <laughs> we are. We actually tried to get a webcam, but they're all sold out. Like everyone and their brother is doing Facebook Lives right now. So um, mm -hmm. we're just you're just going to have to bear with us, and um, we'll keep being here for you. And, and we love you for it. Yeah, yeah but we're too. looking forward to a weekend, and we'll see you next Monday. Yeah, see you next week. All right, All right. bye.